Try this. Tissues. What am I supposed to do with these? Sneeze myself to sleep? Stuff them in your ears, lame brain. Ooh, it's actually a good idea. Hey, I think it's working. <laughs> I knew it was too good to be true. Looks like a nice night to camp outside. You've got to be kidding me. <laughs> Deep fried tentacles. <laughs> this isn't working. That's it! I'll go gray matter and just crawl into a nice, quiet place. Rip Jaws. Oh, man. Now what am I going to do? Ah, uh, peace and quiet. <laughs> Engines covered in some kind of fungus. Well, looks like we're hunkering down here for a while. Gets it here. Now you kids remain put and keep an eye on Gilbert. I'll see what I can rustle up for us from the kitchen. Grandpa, rustling up a meal? Now that's a scary thought. There's gotta be a care package around here somewhere. <laughs> Can't you guys just share? Like sharing the same birthday with a relative every single year? You don't get it. Then they're twins. <laughs> Born on the same day? I knew that. They're here! All around us! Who's here? Ah! That sounded like Grandpa! Don't go out there! They'll find you! Chill. I have animal instinct. <laughs> Mm-hmm. 
No way! That, that, that motorcycle, it was driving itself. Where's Ben? Long chase, hot day. I'm thinking. You okay? <laughs> I'll uh, take that as a no. Well, 101. Sorry, Ben. It's official. You have a summer cold. Maybe from now on, you'll think twice before having snack time inside an ice cream truck. <sighs> hey, that's my new blouse! <laughs> Maybe from now on, you'll think twice about leaving your new clothes just lying around. <laughs> This for a video game? I don't believe it. <laughs> Lieutenant Steele, Special Alien Containment Team. We'll take it from here. Concussion Bazooka! That doesn't look good. Must be a logical explanation, right? Are you demented? Going alien just to get a stupid video game? What are you talking about? You going forearm freaky in front of that store, that's what I'm talking about. Now I'm sure he has a good explanation. Don't you, Ben? Yeah. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, sure. Just like you never put an empty milk bottle back in the refrigerator, or you never leave the shower all gunked up, or you never, ever leave the toilet seat up in the middle of the night. You never do anything wrong, do you? Sounds about right. Ugh. Look, I don't know if some encyclopedia or something fell in your head at the bookstore, but you have no evidence I did anything wrong. Oh, yeah? That's not me! Oh, no. I'm sure it's just some other four-armed alien going postal in front of a video game store. Gwen. It's possible. Remember when that diamond head alien turned out to be a good guy? In fact, all the alien species in the Watch live out in the universe somewhere. Uh, that's true. Besides, Ben wouldn't be so irresponsible with his alien powers like that. Grandpa, please. All right, maybe you have a point. No one's gonna ruin my alien's reputation, except me. Ladies and gentlemen, I want to thank all of you for your support of my downtown redevelopment program. It's truly a dream come true. Better make that a nightmare, Councilwoman. You. You're the nut job who wouldn't leave. Nice to know we've made an impression. What are you doing? Just bringing you home for dinner. You're the main course. This looks like a job for. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Has Ben 
god rabbit or what? Ben's cold must be affecting Wild Mutt's sense of smell. With his schnoz clogged, he can't tell where he's going. Okay, furball. I'm driving. Ah! Go left! No! Your other left! Now would ya? Hey, short, dumb, and hairy. Rule one, he's not Grandpa. He's an alien freak. And that leads to rule two, which is we kick alien butt. 
to nobody, Slick. You sorry. I speak. You listen. These eyes see everything on this ship. And these hands control everything on this ship. And I have decided that your relationship will make you an entertaining team in the arena. Team? No! I'm not going around tied to this loser! You took the words right out of my mouth! Your fates are now linked. If one of you should happen to expire, the shackles will ensure the other does as well. Now, your next opponent awaits. There's only room for one champion here. Me! Give it a rest, Kev. This is both our problems. Huh? Great! Now I'm stuck with a stupid piece of dead weight. Not for long. Remember the whole your fates are now link speech? It was only like two minutes ago. Rescue formation Alpha 9. It's the tapes. I hate tapes. Vision set forth in the Galactic Code of Conduct. I order you to surrender. Will you yield? Yield? What is this, a traffic light? Kick their butts before they try to pull something! <laughs> What's a big, strong alien like you doing on a planet like this? We make a good team, don't we? Yes! Saved by the beast! Hey! Where'd the rest of you go? Uh, sorry. I'm just a kid. I just get some extra hands once in a while. So, it is true. The Omnitrix is in the possession of a child. We heard you were of somewhat limited mental capacity. No offense. Don't worry, he gets that all the time. Greetings. I am Ultimos, the Specimen Prime. This is Synaptak and Tiny. We are the Galactic Enforcers. Whoa, the uniforms, the moves, you guys rock! Finally, some other superheroes I can hang with! As per the Galactic Code of Conduct, we hereby officially request clearance to operate in your quadrant. Uh, sure. Then we have much to discuss. Ha! Bingo! 
Looks like I win again. That makes a whole week where I get to ride in front. It's not fair. My cart is filled with harder things to find than yours. I'm just better at it than you. Sorry, Freakazoid. Better luck next time. What do you say we go one more time? Double or nothing? You want to spend two whole weeks riding in the back? You're on. I just need to use the bathroom first. All right, doofus, let's play. Ooh, look at that, a roasted turkey. Guess your luck may have run out. Looks like I just needed a little time to get the hang of this game. And if I'm not mistaken, my final item is right there. A family of geese! That's my last item! I win. What? I swear I put an ice sculpture there. It must have melted. Aha! Uh -huh. Even when you cheat, you can't beat me. Looks like you're stuck in the back seat. Only for two weeks, doofus. I don't think so, Ben. You're grounded to the back seat for a month. That watch isn't for cheating. Ben. Ah, uh, cheer up, Ben. It's a long way to Flagstaff. Triple or nothing. <laughs> Ugh, why do old people's houses always smell like somebody's cooking socks or something? Ooh, Vera, this is delicious. Uh, now, what are these brown chunks in the mold? Pork chops, and the white parts are cauliflower. So, Ben, what have you been doing so far this summer? Dealing with alien life forms. Oh, you. Aunt Vera, is that a stuffed red-billed North American chickadee? Oh, how perceptive, Gwen. And did you know the song of the red-billed North American chickadee is actually... A, a call indicating alarm or excitement? I am totally stuffed. Ben, would you like some candy? Now we're talking. Ugh. Coffee? As a candy? Is this some kind of joke? I need to use the bathroom. It's Attack of the Old People. I gotta get out of here. one is a Valentiana. Can you hear the ocean? Loser. Loser. <laughs> ben? See ya. Wouldn't want to be ya. There has to be something fun to do around here. Thank <laughs> you. 